In 1877, these gentlemen who had been hunting together decided to bench their dogs and show that they could both be champions in the field and also on the bench. This was the birth of the Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show. Born a sportsman's organization at heart, the Westminster Kennel Club was formed to create a little friendly competition amongst men and their companions. Decades before there was a dog show, often they owned these dogs in a syndication or a kennel. They enjoyed the camaraderie of each other, the competition much like it even is here today. And it was a club, a club of gentlemen who shared similar interests. While confirmation competitions judge the dogs on their breed standard and form, performance events are a unique opportunity to replicate a landscape that dogs might have been challenged with centuries ago. There are several performance-based events in the sport of dogs that test specific skills. When we talk about field trials specifically, we refer to mock hunting experiences where purpose-bred dogs demonstrate their ability to perform the tasks their breeds were originally designed for. When it comes to field trials, sporting breeds are the dogs you'll find at these events. There are field trials for pointing, retrieving, and flushing dogs. Because of the time period when Westminster was established, the first show mainly featured sporting breeds, including setters, spaniels, retrievers, and pointers. These breeds served a functional purpose in the household, an integral part of their families in the late 1800s and early 1900s. Each field trial is catered towards the specific breed functions, but in general, handlers will provide direction on what a dog is searching for, and the dog will execute the commands to complete the task at hand. To be a judge at an AKC Pointing Breed Championship field trial, a person must possess critical factors. First, the judge must be highly familiar with the traits of the different breeds and have vast experience competing in the field themselves. There are rules to follow when judging, such as noting the regular cadence of finding game, and staying steady to wing, which means the dog stands still while the bird is flushed or flies out from the brush. Once judging at a competition, the judge looks for how well the handler and dog work together. And if there's a horseback class division at the trial, the horse also becomes part of that team. Watching the dog and handler teamwork is an incredible sight to the casual spectator. Still, the judge is looking for dogs that connect to the handler with minimal handling to accomplish the task. The dog should know what is expected by the handler, follow commands given, but make an independent decision when out in the field. This combination proves that the dog understands the job. The dog's overall demeanor is also taken into consideration by the judge. How it uses the wind, covers the grounds, and hunts the cover where game birds are likely to be. And then how it locks to a point when finding the game. Since its inception, the Westminster Kennel Club has been involved in performance sports in a variety of ways, from hosting competitions in upstate New York to recognizing top dogs at the AKC Pointing Breed Gun Dog Championships. In fact, the club's emblem is a pointer, one of the breeds used for the first performance-based events. This image is modeled after an actual dog named Sensation, whom the Westminster Kennel Club imported from England in the 1870s to improve breeding stock in America. Among the many benefits of participating in field trials is an improved bond between the handler and the dog and identifying superior dogs who may improve a bloodline. A dedication to responsible breeding of purpose-bred dogs has always been at the core of Westminster's mission. To continue the tradition of supporting dogs in the field, each year at the AKC Pointing Breed Championships, the club awards the Westminster Kennel Club Cup to the winner of the horseback division and the Westminster Trophy to the walking division champion. Westminster is proud of its legacy of promoting dogs in the show ring and in the field.